Hello, beautiful beings. What is up? My name is Jeanette, also known as Misfit Vegan. I'm making juice, um, and I want to talk to you about fennel. But first, I want to ask you a question. Have you ever been through a storm? Maybe you're going through a storm right now, like outside. Outside, there's a really bad storm. But see, I'm not scared because I know it's not going to last forever. Yeah, it's bad, and the power even went out. But see, I know, and you know, that storm outside is not going to last forever. And this is what I want you to understand with your health condition. If you're overweight, or you're in pain right now, or you just can't stop eating junk food, or you're dealing with anorexia or bulimia or a food addiction or, or anything, anything that is hurting you. Maybe you have anything, any health issue. Please understand that if you take the right actions, if you put one foot in front of the other and you just, you just do something about it, this too shall pass. This too shall pass. You see, the only constant in life is change. And the storm never, ever lasts. So if you're doing the right thing, okay, if you're eating healthy, this too shall pass. If you don't know how to eat healthy, guess what? Your job is to consume content and read books and watch documentaries to help make it easy for you to eat healthier. I understand it can be very frustrating. I understand that you feel like hopeless or there's there's no way. But I want to encourage you to watch your fucking words. Watch your words. If you say there's no way for you to stop, if you feel, if you say if you keep saying there's no way I can do this. There's no way. Well, guess what? There is no way. There is no way. Life and death is in the tongue. There is no way if you say there's no way. But if you just put one foot in front of the other, maybe you have a juicer. Maybe you're going to make one green juice every day. Do something every day. Do something every single day to move the needle forward to your healthy version, to the person that you want to be. You don't have to be perfect, but you got to do one thing a day. So I just want to encourage you and I want you to know this will pass. This is not forever. That's why you're depressed. That's why you're feeling overwhelmed. That's why you're you're feeling stuck and hopeless because you think this is forever. This is not forever. This is a season in your life. You're being tested to see what you're going to do. Everything is a test. When you get that craving, it's a test. Are you going to choose to make nice cream or, or eat some mangoes? Or some bananas? Or are you going to just go to the store and get some Snickers? You failed the test. Start passing enough tests. And guess what? You're going to believe in yourself again. And then it's going to be easy, my boo. You got to start passing some tests. And you can do it. And by the way, you got to change your language too. If you refuse to change your language, I can't help you. If you refuse to say, I can do this, then you're hopeless. You're truly hopeless. And you need to stop watching this content. And you need to just watch. You need to just play video games and watch the Kardashians because you're hopeless. But if you can muster up the courage and the strength to say, I can do this. I can do this. Well, then guess what? You can do it. You can fucking do it. Okay, so the video is actually about fennel. (laughs) But I just wanted to tell you that because I feel that somebody needed to hear it. So fennel is an amazing, amazing uh, ingredient in green juice that I love to use at least once a week. And the reason I love fennel so much is because it is so powerful. It's great for people with anemia. It's absolutely amazing for digestive issues. It's great for diarrhea. It's great if you're nauseous. Fennel is amazing. It even increases, they say, they say, it increases milk production in women who have just given birth, okay? Uh, Fennel is great for your skin. It's a true superfood, but I swear every single fruit and vegetable is a superfood, but I love fennel, and I love it especially because of the taste. It tastes like licorice. So what I do with fennel is 
I put it in my green juice, but always, and I put the whole thing in. I cut it up, okay? So I have such a tiny counter, but basically I just cut it like this. I just cut the end off. I put it in the juicer just like this, the whole top and the bottom, and sometimes I munch on it. I know somebody that likes to roast fennel. It tastes really good roasted. I had it once, but I like to juice it because I like it to be alive and full of all the enzymes, the vitamins and minerals and nutrients. You know, you do kill all the nutrients when you cook things, so eat as much raw as possible, my boo, and you'll feel as alive as possible. And so um, the reason I love fennel is because of the taste, like I said. But the key is you've got to mix it with apple and lemon. So what I like to do is I like to put in greens. So in here I have, I have spinach, I have kale, I have cucumber, I have apple, lemon, fennel. Make sure whatever juice you're making, add your greens in, okay? But always do those three combinations, apple, fennel, lemon. It tastes so delicious, you will not be sorry. Of course, you can put in some ginger if you want. Uh, I do like ginger. Um, but this is such a winning combination, you will not be sorry. Your skin will glow. You will have less bloating. It's great for people with acid reflux. Okay, any type of digestive issues. Fennel is so, so good for you. I swear, it's great for everything. So I highly recommend you check out fennel next time you go to the store. Try your very best to get the fennel with the tops because sometimes they cut off the tops and I don't know why, but try to get that. It's a really cool um, root vegetable and it tastes just like licorice. So if you like licorice, you will love fennel. Thank you guys very much for listening. Please understand that if you're in a valley, there's absolutely nowhere to go but up. If you're at the bottom, it's a beautiful, amazing place because that's where change happens. And you've got to start taking it one meal at a time. And you've got to change your language. I can do this has to be your mantra. It has to, because the opposite is I can't do this and it's getting you nowhere, my boo. It's getting you nowhere and it's getting you nothing. Change your language starting today. If nothing else, change your language and your entire life will change. I love you. I'll see you in the next video. Bye, boo.